Good afternoon, everyone. Can everybody hear me okay? I'm Lieutenant Colonel Grobner, and I want, want to thank all of you for attending and supporting this event. I'd like to share an experience. As many of us do, when I found out I was pregnant, you have so many dreams. You tell your husband, you tell your family, you bring in your mom, and bring in all your best friends, and you tell them that you're pregnant, and, and you already start to imagine what it's gonna be like to have that baby in your arms. During the pregnancy, I found out I was carrying twins. Well, one morning, I was at my OB visit, I'm sitting there and I feel a gush. So I go up to the front desk, I let the nurse know, they take me back, they send me to sonogram, and they tell me I've lost one of them. And your heart breaks, your heart breaks. All those dreams go out. So what do we do? We call our friends, we call our parents, we call a brother or sister. And the thing is, is you want that support, you want that understanding? The one thing that we forget is that we're not grieving alone. My husband was supportive, and he was. Um, he went through a little bit of a hard time too, you know? And, and there's people around you. If you take a look right now, you can see people around you that have shared in something similar. And you can take a look at everybody here on the tables, and there's groups, and there's people, and there's support groups such as this one that are here to help you and to support you and to get through that moment. Our children and their footprints will always be in our hearts and we will always remember them and we will always carry them with us and we will always carry the dreams that we have. As time marches on, the faces of Charlie Company will change until no one inside the company personally knew any of the fallen nine soldiers. But those new faces will know the history of Charlie Company, the names of our fallen, and where they fell because of memorials like this sign. To the folks of Trigg County, you have my personal gratitude for all that you have done and continue to do for our soldiers and our military families. You have my professional admiration for the way you helped manage the tragedy and help to heal our military families through the use of the most powerful tool, community.